Hey there guys, my name is Brandon, aka Sons Geek, and if it has to deal with the Phoenix Suns, I'm going to make a video about it. That is right, guys, before we get started, make sure to Hulk smash that like button, and please subscribe for everything Phoenix Suns. If it has to deal with the Phoenix Suns, I'm going to make a video about it, and let's dive right into the video. During this Phoenix Suns win streak, you guys, when the Phoenix Suns set a franchise record 18 wins in a row, I feel like there really wasn't much to talk about. You would think with all this winning that there would be so much stuff to talk about. So I feel like it's been a while since I've done one of these kinds of videos. And this is just a couple of things that I thought was worth talking about. And I wanted to start off with Cameron Johnson, who I think has really improved since his rough start to the season. You know, earlier in the season, his shot seemed off. He wasn't really consistent. And we only saw flashes of what he can do and then in my opinion he really broke out of it it's like he snapped out of it in his last 10 games he has averaged 24 minutes per game shooting 51 percent from the field 50 percent from three and is averaging 12 points per game now in the win versus san antonio spurts he didn't really shoot the best percentages but he did finish with 13 points three assists and he had two steals and he had a really nice pass to deandre ayton for the slam late in the game. And that was a clutch moment in the Phoenix Suns win versus the Spurs. And in Cam Johnson's last four games, he has a total of 58 points. He's been super aggressive. He's been attacking the rim. He has been making plays. He keeps showing signs of growth and improvement. Now, I did want to talk about the Phoenix Suns winning streak and the history behind it that you may or may not know. There have been a total of 24 win streaks of 17 games or more in NBA history. And of those 21 streaks, Chris Paul has now been a part of three of them, a first for any player in NBA history. Chris Paul obviously did this with the Los Angeles Clippers, the Houston Rockets, and the franchise record 18-game win streak with the Phoenix Suns. And you guys, Chris Paul has been absolutely fantastic during that win streak. You know, I think he's putting up 14 points per game, 10 assists, and two steals or something like that. He has been fantastic in the clutch and has been scoring for the Phoenix Suns when it mattered. It all starts and ends with Chris Paul, and he has been doing an incredible job for this Phoenix Suns team. And also, you guys, when the Phoenix Suns beat the Golden State Warriors to close the month of November out, they finished with 16 wins and zero losses. They were now the seventh team in NBA history to go 16-0 and or better in a calendar month. And the 18-game win streak was also a career best for head coach Monty Williams, who, by the way, Monty Williams and his staff deserve a lot of credit for the Phoenix Suns win streak. So shout out to Monty Williams. And you guys, just to end the video, I just wanted to go over the rest of the schedule for December. Now, I'm not going to break down each and every single game, just some notable teams who we are playing. So to start it off, you guys, we do face the Boston Celtics next. They are a decent team. And then we versus the Los Angeles Clippers, who we possibly could see in the playoffs once again. And then there's three games in a row that have a lot of question marks around them. Like we play the Portland Trailblazers. There's obviously a lot going on with them. Uh, their season has kind of been a disaster. And then we versus the Washington Wizards, who they started off the season really good, but they've been losing kind of as of late. But they are a good team. I do believe that they will make the playoffs. So they might be a little hard to beat. And then we play the Charlotte Hornets. Then we play the Los Angeles Lakers on December 21st. Obviously, that's going to be a matchup that lots of people are going to be watching. I do think we have a great chance to win because the Lakers have just been bad this season. And then obviously on Christmas Day, we verse the Golden State Warriors. I am so excited for our first Christmas Day game in what, literally like a decade and then we versus the Memphis Grizzlies. And then to close out the year 2021 on December 31st, we face the Boston Celtics. Again, the Phoenix Suns and the Golden State Warriors are the first team to 20 wins. So I just wanted to make this Phoenix Suns news video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to Hulk smash that like button and please subscribe for everything Phoenix Suns. If it has to deal with the Phoenix Suns, I'm going to make a video about it. As always, guys, please leave me your thoughts, comments, and opinions down below. And make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.